Surveillance video shows Melissa Sandrone in March of 2018 as she came loaded with an arsenal of guns and knives to M&M Motors in West Dallas. She shot one of the owners in the back of the head as others ducked for cover. Inside her car, police found the book The Art of War. The criminal complaint says she blamed one of the owners for a head injury she suffered 14 years ago. For phase two of the trial, a judge has to determine if the suspect was mentally responsible at the time of the shooting. A doctor who testified says she is psychotic, paranoid and delusional. Your client was suffering from unspecified schizophrenia spectrum and other psychotic disorder and also had a history of marijuana abuse. There's consistent information across different sources of records that your client was delusional for years leading up to the offenses in this case. The prosecution argued Sandrone planned and carried out the attack. It appears that this was planned or thought out, correct? In some rudimentary way, I suppose so, but certainly she made no sophisticated efforts to evade detection or responsibility of this case, given how easily identifiable and locatable she was within a very short time of the attempted homicides. Sandrone is due back in court Thursday. That's when the judge says he will have his decision ready. It could mean life in prison or many years in a psychiatric care facility. At the Milwaukee County Courthouse, I'm Hillary Mintz, WISN 12 News. Sandrone pleaded no contest to two counts of attempted homicide. The victim who was shot survived.